If you're tired of always having the same apps, here's the three ways to discover and download new ones for free. As counterintuitive as that might sound, Google Plus communities are an excellent way to find and download new apps. Tons of developers have the wonderful habit of releasing beta versions of their apps through Google+. Usually, you just have to subscribe to the community, activate the beta version, and you're good to go to download the latest apps. They are also free in the vast majority of cases, as you're getting content before it reaches its final form, and it can present some bugs here and there. In my opinion, that's just a small price to pay for an awesome opportunity. You can also do that for mainstream apps and get the latest updates before everyone else. I'm currently subscribed to the beta versions of Nova Launcher, WhatsApp and Facebook, and trust me, that's awesome. A similar service is offered by the XDA forums. Now of course XDA is much more than that, but as for the purpose of this video, the apps and games section will be enough. Over there, you'll find the best apps from indie developers and from bigger ones too. Again, because they are often betas, you'll have to be careful on what you download, but I've never had any major problem with their apps and you can always trust the feedback of XDA users, should you have any doubt. The third and probably the most secure, in some sense, way of downloading free apps is the Amazon App Store. Thanks to their app of the day section, you'll get a paid app for free every day. Honestly, the app quality varies widely from day to day, but you'll sure find some great apps and games like Leo's Fortune, Ripted, GP2, Monument Valley and so on. Also, the greatest offering of the Amazon App Store are the collections they publish from time to time, giving you access, for free, to almost a hundred bucks of paid apps. So these were our favorite ways of discovering new free apps, but if you have some other suggestion be sure to share that with us in the comment section right below. Thank you so much for watching, Joe here, and I'll catch you guys next Monday.